Hi, I hope everyone had a good week. In this week's episode, we are decorating an apartment with some Halloween decor. I am super duper excited for Halloween. Let me know in the comments what everyone else is dressing up as. I'm going as Louise from Bob's Burgers. Anyway, so today we are starting off in the Hackham House um, in the apartment building from City Living. Um, I do have that pack as well. That pack is a really good pack, so I would definitely recommend you guys getting it if if you don't already. Um, so in this episode, I'm just starting off by obviously putting up the kitchen, making sure everything is all set in the kitchen first. Um, I believe I did the living room afterwards. Um, I ended up changing... So I started off with this wall color, which is like a, a dark brownish color. I ended up changing that just because I, I don't know, I just didn't really like how it looked per se. It does look pretty nice, I'm gonna be honest with you, but I, I actually, I kind of want to do this color in my next build. Um, I believe the next episode, I don't know what I'm doing so far, but in my next build, I am probably going to use that color because that color is super pretty. Um... So yeah, I do, I do really, really like it. I just did a basic kitchen. I wasn't going to do anything too over-the-top crazy. Just because I was like, you know what? It's just a basic kitchen. Like, I don't need any, like, special, anything special. It's just basic kitchen. Like, that's it, you know? And so, anyways... I did that and then I forgot that I didn't have the cheat on so I ended up using the cheat the BB dot move objects so that way you can place everything wherever you want to place it I totally forgot to <laughs> do that in the beginning I need to start doing that in the beginning just because it's it's obviously a necessary cheat like you you cannot build without that cheat so anyways, I ended up moving the lights around and just because I wanted the lights like over the sink and like right by the door. I felt like that was weird to like put the lights just in random places. Like who does that? You want them to be like spread out but like still look pretty nice. So I was just looking at the different spooky stuff for um because I wanted to decorate the house as Halloween because like I said, I am super duper excited for Halloween so yes okay um now i'm just looking at different objects as far as what i wanted to use in the kitchen to decorate it and stuff like that i knew i definitely wanted to use that plant o lantern that thing that thing is super duper cute like look at it look at these pumpkins they glow they light up they're super cute like i wish i had this in my house in real life like those are super cute okay i ended up putting one next to the door i believe i moved that i don't remember but i believe i moved that um but either way it looks super cute like i really like those those lanterns they're really really cute um so I'm still looking at the kitchen. I'm still I'm still deciding on what I want to do with the kitchen. I knew I needed a trash bin because we don't want no trash around our apartment. Hell no. Nah. We don't want no trash. So I put a trash bin for obvious reasons, especially in the kitchen cuz why would you want to walk across the entire house just to throw away your trash? Like that makes no sense. So now I'm just putting in the kitchen islands i ended up doing the same exact color as the um kitchen itself i did like a nice little island i ended up using an orange i tried to find an orange like stool that would look really well with um you know just halloween in general because we want that halloween vibe okay and halloween is like usually orange right so yeah um i really like how it turned out it turned out pretty nice um yeah so i ended up doing the orange because i really liked the orange and the black because of, for obvious reasons it's a halloween house why wouldn't you have orange or black um 
then next I started on the living room. So the living room I did the couch and then the two chairs next to the couch and then I wanted to do that one but then I was like the purple doesn't go well with the orange but then the black actually kind of matches the table um, that has the TV on it so I ended up using that rug because I don't know I just thought it was really nice and it like matched the vibes and stuff I felt like the orange pumpkin one was just too much orange for my liking like yeah you definitely want orange in a house but like in a halloween house but like why would you want so much orange that is just not bearable like you you would not want that at all um i ended up looking at the different tables that we had i ended up going with the black one just because like i said i felt like the orange is just too much um because it is definitely too much like orange 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 no you want like orange black like you know maybe some purple here and there but like not orange 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 like why would you want that i ended up putting some jack-o-lanterns around the house just because i thought it was super cute like i'm like oh my god like yes look at that that is super cute i ended up move i think i moved that but i don't know either way it looks super cute um, I just was trying to debate on where I wanted to put it. I ended up putting it there in the corner just because I felt like it was out of the way and it still looked cute enough to be put there. I ended up putting that jack-o'-lantern on that little table right there. And then, um, you know, as you walk in, you just see this little jack-o'-lantern with a little witch hat on. I thought the witch hat was just, uh, it put everything together. So now I am starting on with the dining room. I ended up doing like an open feel for the kitchen, living room, and dining room. Um, just so, I don't know, I felt like the open feel just looked better, in my opinion. It looked like, I don't know, I just felt like it looked better. Um, so yeah, I ended up going with like a black table just because I felt like the black was like basic, but like it matched. You know what I mean? Like black matches everything. So why wouldn't you want to do black? Um, I ended up looking at the different chairs. I looked at the folding chairs and I was thinking about those. And then I was like, you know what? I don't like this. So then I ended up changing it um, to other t other chairs. I looked and looked and looked and looked. And then I found that, that um, black and brown chair. And I really like those chairs. Like that chair looks really nice. Like... I don't know they they just look really nice and they look really nice with that table i ended up doing a bedroom as well i i did two bedrooms a bathroom and then i did like a little like office kind of room i guess you would call it i don't know how else to call it um here's me looking in the bathroom as well um i i mean the bathroom is pretty functional it's not like cute but obviously it's functional because like i don't know it's just it's a functional bathroom okay I didn't want to do anything too extra maybe one of these days I'll do something extra but this one is just basic I wanted to do more of the de decoration like outside like um in the living room and in the kitchen and stuff like that um but obviously we needed a bathroom because if your sim has to poop then your sim has to poop like is that simple i ended up painting the bathroom orange as well just because like i said i wanted it to be like a halloweeny vibe and halloween is orange so for obvious reasons we would want an orange bathroom okay there's me i ended up putting the um putting the soap i like i really like putting the soap like on top on the edge of the sink like that i don't know why it just puts everything together it just it puts it together okay and so yeah and i believe i ended up putting like some towels on top of the laundry basket there i do like that look as well it it makes it look like someone lives there you know what i mean and it looks super nice like it fits perfectly on there Ex like perfectly as you can see um, I was just looking at different items to put in the bathroom. I think I ended up, um, not putting much in there. Like I said, it's a functional bathroom. I didn't want to do too much on there. I did put a bunch of, like, um, spider webs, um, cobwebs, and, like, some rips in the walls and stuff. Because, like I said, 
Halloween vibes, okay? I kind of want to do another video as well. Let me know in the comments as well. So, I want to do a video where we make the, the person that lives in this house. Um, I want to do like, maybe like a small like, um, either a vampire. I want to do a vampire because I put a coffin in the bedroom. I want to do a vampire because this is definitely like a vampire-y house. I mean, come on. Vampires, Halloween, boom. It goes together very well. So, for obvious reasons, I want a vampire to live in this house. But, I don't know like what kind of vampire. I don't know if I want two vampires or one vampire. I feel like it's two because there's two bedrooms. But one bedroom has a coffin and then the other bedroom has a bed. I feel like I can go back in and like change it from the bed to like another coffin. But um, I don't know. I, I feel like it came out really good. But... I don't, I don't know it I just feel like I want a vampire I know I want a vampire to live in this house because why wouldn't a vampire live in this house um have you guys ever seen that show my babysitter's a vampire one time I legit tried to make like the whole cast but like in the sims it did not turn out well like at all none of them looked like what they actually looked like and like <laughs> looking back at it i tried so hard and it did not look good at all and i was like maybe 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 no no nah. and i ended up like i deleted them i don't know if they're still on my save file because they probably they're, they're probably still saved somewhere um, I just have to go digging for it. I ended up deleting them because they did not look good. I kind of want to try to remake them, but I don't, I, I don't know yet. I, I legit don't know yet, but that was literally my favorite show. And now that I'm talking about it, I kind of want to watch it tonight, especially because like I said, I'm super duper excited for Halloween and I feel like me watching my babysitter's a vampire is gonna make me even more hyped. Like, mm, hyped. So I'm also doing like some carving pumpkins. Has anybody like carved pumpkins like um, recently or is going to? Oh my goodness, I am super duper excited. Like, pumpkins are everything, especially carving them. It's so much fun. And then like you get to eat the pumpkin seeds after and like uh it is so much fun so yeah i'm doing that next week and i'm gonna do jack skellington so wish me luck guys because i don't know if i can do it i don't know if i can do it but i hope i can because i i hope i can I believe in myself okay the world may not believe in me but i believe in me i can do it but anyways um i was just putting like a bunch of holes in the wall and like little like stains and stuff to make it look more like creepy i guess you would say i'm not really creepy but like you get the idea you know it's halloween we want it to look like that so i put a bunch of cobwebs every like spider webs everywhere um cobwebs whatever you want to call it i put like stains and like cracks in the walls and like i did those creepy lights from the vampire pack as well and yeah i mean it turned out really good i am super proud of it and so yeah so also i don't know whether i'm gonna do like one pumpkin or like one big pumpkin and one small one i'm probably gonna do like one big pumpkin and just do jack skellington on that pumpkin that would be super cute but um yeah i really love how this house turned out mostly i really love how the um living room and the dining room came out the kitchen came out pretty nice too i did an orange backdrop for the kitchen you can't really see it um but i did do an orange backdrop for the kitchen i did like white and then like orange for the backdrop but here is the photo of the of 
you know everything it looks super nice i am super proud of it i hope you guys have a wonderful week i will see you guys in the next video thank you so much